Welcome in, welcome in, welcome in everyone. How you guys doing? Um, let's start like this. If you guys are here, that subscribe, like, share. Thank you for tuning in. Also, I'm on Patreon. Go follow me over on Patreon. And for those, it's free to subscribe, you know what I'm saying? And for those who decide to choose a lifetime membership, I'll be doing a free reaction. Well, really two reactions for those who pick the lifetime membership. Um, just something to entice people but yeah let's get straight into this because i've had a few phone calls telling me yo fam have you listened to the new j cole have you heard the new j cole and i'm kind of like um what's happening out here i mean last time i heard from j cole was when he did that feature and i mean there's been a lot of controversy ever since the whole bbl drizzy and k dot kung fu kenny kind of vibes you could tell by the way i kind of said the names um which side we standing on here, right? But yeah, um, we got J. Cole um, releasing a track. And me saying all of that, you know, because there's been so much controversy and J. Cole still is in my top three. That's the real facts. We got K-Dot, then we got J. Cole. I'm not even having a debate. I'm not even trying to argue it. That's just my personal opinion. So regardless of what he says in this track, I still got J. Cole there, still one of the best lyricists out there. You know what I'm saying? Um, my friend tried not to tell me too much. He goes, bruv, he, he's answering a few things. And that's all I was told. He's answering. He's replying to a few things. So I'm mean, like, hmm. What have we been, we've been talking about with J. Cole, you know? He ran from the beef. Is he considered to be in the top three? Um, and really, I think he made a smart decision. Somebody gave him a heads up. Like, yo, fam, this beef ain't got nothing to do with you. Nothing to do with you. Step out of the lane, bruv. You know what I'm saying? Like, and he did a smart thing. While it was going on, J. Cole was on an island just meditating with a smile on his face. Let's go, man. We got J. Cole here. Get this off. Port Antonio. Port Antonio. Where's Port Antonio? Made me want to go look this up. Hold up there. I ain't trying to catch me off. There's always a reason. Where's Port Antonio? It is the island's third largest port, famous... Which island? Shipping point for Bahamas. Point for bah oh, bananas. All right, look at me saying it. Bananas and coconut. Um, yeah, bro, YouTube, you're so... All right, all right, all right, Jamaica. I'm about to go, what the hell are you telling me about? Port Antonio. All right, then. Sounds familiar, but all right, all right. I wonder why he named the track that, then. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of beef you gonna have on this, yeah? Mm. Yeah, this sounded like some old school hip hop. Like, 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 real old school hip hop. I almost wanted to have that kind of a. A Lauren Hilly kind of a Nazi kind of feel on this, you know what I'm saying? Already, just from the yeah. Okay, poor Antonio, yeah. Okay, so I guess he's gonna be rapping, rapping. J. Cole's always rapping, rapping, bro. Uh. Let's go. Yo, Jermaine walked the straight and narrow Minimum wage jobs for the narrow But still my mind was on the zeros I fiend for the perks that was seen flipping birds So we... right, he's, he's taking a trip back into memory lane Talking about the old him What he had to go through before this, yeah? Alright, minimum wage, yeah? We hear you, my boy mm. Mm. Young Jermaine walked the straight and narrow Minimum wage jobs for the narrow But still my mind was on the zeros I fiend for the perks that was seen flipping birds So we were skipping church but my eyes was on the sparrows Niggas flipping pies, spending thousands on apparel Shit, I wanna shine too I want dimes too. Mm. Jealous niggas wanna know just how my rhymes blew. 
mano y mano, I'm Bono, I'm you times two. Now hey, I'm Uzi, I done outgrew the fountain. Hey, 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 what's that fucking YouTube Bono kind of flip bar right there? I ain't doing no bar breakdown. I don't really do bar breakdowns. You know, I try to catch what I can catch, but in the first listen to me with a lot of tracks, it's so hard to break down everything. I just want to hear the track. And then and there's so many reactors doing bar breakdowns, so you know, I'll just do my little bit. But yo, yeah, I heard that YouTube, that YouTube bar right there, my boy. Okay, this okay. Know just how my rhymes blew. Mano y mano, I'm Bono, I'm you times two. Now I'm bougie, I done outgrew the fountain blue. But never forgot the spot where I developed my plot. The dwell at the top, the veer where all my skeletons lock. If I could do it all over, then I never would swap. I seen mm. good, I seen bad, had my melanin mocked. I seen lifelong friends turn to devilish ops. I was Mike and Red Leather trying to tell him to stop. You better hey. beat it for. Hey, 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 you know some and as well too. I need to engage with my audience a bit more. So you guys let me know. Hit me down in them comments, yeah? You understand? And uh, is Jake and Drake officially on bad terms? I've been hearing so many reports, seeing so many people talking about it, but I ain't seen no factual evidence. Like, ever since it's all vibe, because I think Drake took a few shots at J. Cole for the fact that he pulled out of the battle or whatever that he's the one who dragged him into anyways. You know what I'm saying? Um, are they cool? They not cool. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, y'all let me know. I'm in the UK, so I got, I'm going to read the comments. I'm going to hear what y'all told me. Before you see that heavy metal get pop, he was a mean ass wing with a hell of a shot. But if no team draft king, he gon' bet on the block. Seen lifelong friends turn to devilish ops. I was Mike and Red Leather trying to tell him to stop. You mm. better beat it for you see that heavy metal get pop. He mm. was a mean ass wing with a hell of a shot. But if no team draft king, he gon' bet on the block. He wanna ball till he fall until the federals knock and sit his ass on the bench for moving careless with rock. You hey. can't relate unless your father was not around and your mother went out and found. That's a kind of double entendre too. Yeah, move careless with a rock. And you know the rock, Jay Z, and you know what I'm saying. But obviously, you know the rock as well too. Them out here in the streets, they're slanging that whatever it is. But yeah, let's go. Fall into the federal's knock and sit his ass on the bench for moving careless with rock. You can't relate unless your father was not around and your mother went out and found someone else and they brought him around and mm. they salaries didn't combine when they married and brought you out of that poverty. Then you moved to a soft little part of town so that when you back in the hood, you feel Damn. awkward about it now. Just that she broke down how many families are they he going through? Till he fall into the federal's knock and sit his ass on the bench for moving careless with rock. Mm. You can't relate unless your father was not around and your mother went out and found someone else and they brought him around and they salaries didn't combine when they married and brought you out of that poverty. Then you moved to a soft little part of town. So Damn. You back in the hood, you feel awkward about it now. Damn. Then your confidence start to drown, but the rapper gave you some positive thoughts so you jot him down. Hey. Hey, down. My man out here in the street looking for that father figure that ain't there, you know, and then some other dude come around and he ain't your dad, bro. At the end of the day, but it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? Mama, mama got mate too. We're trying to put food on the table, regardless of what people think or say, you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, let's roll. Ride to it, ride to it, ride to it, ride to it, ride to it. like this, right? This is what I'm saying, man. I fucking love J. Cole when it pours, no diddy. But you know what I'm saying? When it comes to producing real hip hop. This is what we miss. This is the kind of raps like not all this copying, copying, everything sounding the same kind of. You know, you're supposed to listen to a song and know right away who the fuck it is. Not be there like, yo, bro, oh, this sounds like. This sounds like. Yo, yo, it's. No, 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 no. When you hear a rap, you're supposed to know first two seconds. Oh, shit, that's Nas. Yo, fam, that's Jay Z. Yo, that's Snoop. Yo, that's Pop. Yo, fam. Even the. Even. <clears throat> Man, I don't even need to say a word. That's DMX. <laughs> Rest in peace, X man. Miss X man. Shit. Motherfucker didn't even need to talk. He just needed to growl. You knew who it was. They're not beating around the bush. When M when M drops a tune, M just says a word. You know, yo, that's M. Unique. Uniqueness. Ain't copying nobody. They all sound like themselves. Ain't nobody here trying to recreate, duplicate. Man, look it. Hip hop, man. Hip hop needs some. You know, hip hop got life being breathed into it right now. Let's roll. Ride to it. Y'all niggas ain't stopping me. Y'all niggas ain't stopping me. Y'all niggas ain't stopping me. 
Yeah, I wonder who you talking to. Y'all ain't stopping me, bro. Y'all niggas ain't stopping me. Y'all niggas ain't stopping me. Ain't nobody stopping you, my boy. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. Uh, Benjamin Button, cold flows, reverse time To find deliveries good as mine, you gotta search primes I'm scaling heights higher than birds can perch Trying to be something, hoping that peace comes to my cursed mind One thing's for sure that I've matured from my first rhyme I learned long ago you can't please them all and it hurts trying Facts. In this game where all you've got is your name like You can't please all of them and it hurts as fuck just trying bro You hurt yourself trying to please everybody So before you try and please everybody, how about you look in the mirror and you try and please yourself first when you've pleased yourself, you'll be able to put out that kind of energy that will affect those who can't be pleased, whether they want it or not. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, shit, but well, that's facts. Tired and birds can perch trying to be something, hoping that peace comes to my cursed mind. One thing's for sure that I've matured from my first rhyme. I learned long ago you can't please them all, and it hurts trying. Facts. In this game where all you've got is your name, like Dirk, I'm smirking at niggas trying to be smirched mine. Absurd times. With a fake get told it is wise I can see hate in both of your eyes But the third's blind hey. So you search lines But you struggle Which explains the puzzled look On the dull faces the word finds I hate when raps become But like do not disturb signs Can't knock it if I see it's about the door They no raps become do not disturb signs Yo, mind. yo, let's Absurd go times With a fake get told it is wise I can see hate in both of your eyes But the third's blind hey. So you search lines Smirch mine Absurd times With a fake get told it is wise I can see hate in both for your eyes but the third's blind so you search lines but you struggle which explains the puzzle look on the dull faces the word finds i hate when raps become but like do not so the third's blind i wait talk about that third eye bro come on third man. Times, come on bro but a fake get told it is wise i can see hate in both for your eyes but the third's blind so you search lines but you blech, struggle blech, which blech. explains the puzzle look on the dull faces the word finds i hate mm. when raps become but like do not disturb signs can not get it if i see it's about the door they instigate the fuckery because it's profitable But singing stop the violence tools with dudes in hospitals I pulled the plug Yo, 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 he's talking a lot But he could be generalizing just talking on everything happening right now You know what I mean? How media, the record companies, you know what I mean? They like to instigate and cause all this bloodshed and beef amongst our young brothers out here You know what I'm saying? Yeah, definitely within certain sections or areas Yeah, uh, they profit they profit from the from the killings, they profit from the violence, they profit from the type of music where people and you know what I mean, unfortunately it's the it's a cycle that just continues down the generations and it's very hard to be talking and giving um ways in which to get out of it or to avoid it when you're not living in it. You know what I mean? When you're dead, that's all you have with these options. You know what I mean? Which is not even options at all. There's only so much these youths can do. You know what I mean? They literally take what's given to them and try and make a better situation out of it. Problem is, there's a lot of obstacles, bumps and detours and roads that they have to, no choice, have to go through just to try and see a little bit of light at the end of the fucking tunnel. You know what I'm saying? This is where it's a bigger picture with the governments, laws, etc. You know what I mean? Like... Yeah, let's roll, let's roll, let's roll, let's roll. My boy, my boy. They instigate the fuckery because it's profitable. But singing stop the violence tools with dudes in hospitals. Mm. I pulled the plug because I seen where that was about to go. Mm. They wanted blood, they wanted clicks to make their pockets grow. Yo, I pulled the plug, you know. Is he talking about? All right, all right, let's pull this back up. Let's pull this back up. Yo, 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 I think he talking about the beef, innit? Look on the dull faces, the word finds I hate when raps become, but like do not disturb signs mm. Can't knock it if I see it's about the door they instigate the fuckery because it's profitable. Yep. But singing stop the violence tools with dudes in hospitals. Hey. I pulled the plug because I seen where that was about to go. They wanted blood, they wanted clicks to make their pockets grow. They see this fire in my pen and think I'm dodging smoke. I'm yo, 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 yo. He here talking about the whole Kendrick Drizzy beef. He pulled that plug, bruv. Yeah, because that's not the vibe I'm on, bruv. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm pulling pen, y'all think I'm dodging smoke. That's just not on the vibe I'm on, bro. Yeah, yo, yeah, 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 yeah. He, so far, I don't sound like he's picking no sides here, bro. He's just telling, man, straight, like, it is what it is, bro. 
But a fake get told it is wise. I can see hate in both of your eyes, but the third's blind. So you search lines, but you struggle, which explains the puzzled look on the dull faces the word finds. I hate mm. when raps become, but like, do not disturb signs. Yeah. Can I get it if I see it's about the dough? They instigate the fuckery because it's profitable. Hey. The singers stop the violence tunes with dudes in hospitals. I pulled the plug because I seen where that was about to go. They wanted blood, they wanted clicks to make their pockets grow. They right. see this fire in my pen and think I'm dodging smoke. I mm. wouldn't have lost the battle dog, I would have lost the pro. I would have gained the phone and all for what? Just to attain some old props from strangers that don't got a clue what I've been aiming for since the age of 14. Jermaine is no king if that means I gotta dig up dirt and pay the whole team of algorithm bot niggas just to sway the whole thing on social. Yo. Did I start this reaction on saying that J J Jermaine um, Cole, J. Cole up in this motherfucker kind of? My top two year, my top three year. I'm just make sure I said that he in my top three year for a reason. This is reasons like this. Yeah, yeah, my G. Go back to these storytelling kind of days. Let them know. You know, I would have made an enemy out of a guy for what? To please who? Y'all, y'all be joking, bro. Like, that's not what I'm on, bro. My pen and think I'm dodging smoke. I wouldn't have lost the battle dog. I would have lost the pro. Mm. I would have gained the phone. And all for what? Just to attain some old props from strangers that don't got a clue what I've been aiming for. Oh, since yo, yo, yo. And I would have lost the bro, you know. A bro, you know. He talking about K Dot, you know. Like, that's my boy, you know. And he got me here thinking, like, yo, is he like, as much as he's staying neutral, though, but, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is like message to Drake as well, like, yo, fam. K Dot's my brother, you know. Like you, 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 my boy and everything, but K Dot's my brother. Like you know what I'm saying? That that's fam, fam, right there. You fam, but he fam, fam. That's what I'm getting. Well, y'all, let me know in the comments, man. Y'all, let me know in the comments what y'all be thinking. Like, 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 what's your take on all this? I like this. I fucking love this. We need this kind of level of penmanship back in hip hop. This is what we've been missing for. You know, people been saying hip hop is dead. I've been like, nah, I ain't dead. It's been on life support, but now it's gotten a fresh breath of air pumped back into them lungs. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we here for it. Damn, Cole saying enough here, bro. He saying a lot. Let's roll. And all for what? Just to attain some old props from strangers that don't got a clue what I've been aiming for mm. since the age of 14. Jermaine is no king if that means I gotta dig up dirt and pay the whole team of mm. algorithm bot niggas just to sway the whole thing on social hey. media competing for your favorable memes to be mm. considered best to live and rest the weight of both things I understand the thirst of being first that made them both swing protecting legacies so lines got crossed perhaps regrettably my friends went to oh, war walk hold up. live and rest the way hold up he's talking about the, the two of them on social media competing for your favorable memes to be considered best to live and rest the weight of both things I understand the thirst of being first that made them both swing I understand the first for being first that made them both swing yo yo Cole she the legacies so lines got crossed perhaps regrettably my friends went to war I walked away with all they blood on me perhaps re regrettably you mean yeah yeah I hear you for Drake K dot K dot ain't easy enough bro K dot ain't regretted nothing okay dot warned the motherfucker like fam if you want to take it there I will too you can tell you tell lies about me and I'll tell some truths about you. <laughs> yo, yo, Cole, Cole is breaking this down fucking superbly. This is this is a fucking work of art. Let's For go. your favorable memes to be considered best to live and rest, the weight of both things. Mm. I understand the thirst of being first that made them both swing, protecting mm. legacies. So lines got crossed, perhaps regrettably. My friends went to war, I walked away with all they blood on me. Now some will discredit me, try wipe away my pedigree, but hey. please find a nigga out that's rapping this incredibly. Uh, my dog facts to me, I share the words. Fucking facts, yeah, facts. Y'all trying to take away from his legacy, but I find another motherfucker out there who's rapping like fucking J. Cole. And I ain't putting K Dot inside there. Drizzy, Drake ain't even stepping into this fucking into this argument. It's not happening. No, nope, no, nope, no, nope, we're not having it. You ghostwrite, you're not, you're not, and I I love a few songs that's been ghostwritten. You know what I'm saying? I bop to them. I'm like, yo shit. But I'm just saying, if you ghostwrite, you can't come into this argument here. You just can't. You can't. Your pedigree's been watered down. You know what I'm saying? You like maybe a two, 
one line away from being mongrel, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, like your pedigree has been broken down, it ain't the same no more. Nigga out that's rapping this incredibly, uh, my dog texted me, I shared the words he said to me, if you refuse to shoot the gun, don't mean the gun ain't deadly, uh, mm -hmm. I guess it ain't better for a hyper Yo! If you refuse to shoot the gun, that don't mean it's not deadly, bro. Still a fucking deadly piece of weapon right there, bro. You Incredibly, uh, my dog texted me. I share the words he said to me. If you refuse to shoot the gun, don't mean the gun ain't deadly. Uh, Black. I guess in that metaphor, hypothetically, the gun is me. I text her back like, guess a gun ain't what I'm trying to be, my nigga. Hey. They stripped me of my spot and now I'm finally free, my nigga. They say I'm picking. I'm not trying to be that gun, bro. It's me, but I'm, no, I'm, I, that's not the position I want to be in. Yo, let's go, my boy. Me, my nigga. To start another war, hey, Drake, you'll always be my nigga. Hey. I ain't ashamed to say you did a lot for me, my nigga. Fuck all the narratives. Tapping back into your magic pen is what's imperative. Remind hey, man, they giving a shout out to Drake, though. You know what I'm saying? Giving his thanks. And yo, okay, yo, 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 this is... It's real rap here, you know. Let's go. To start another war, hey Drake, you'll always be my nigga. I ain't ashamed to say you did a lot for me, my nigga. Mm. Fuck all the narratives. Tapping back into your magic pen is what's imperative. Reminding yeah, these folks why we do it. It's not for beefing, it's for speaking our thoughts, pushing ourselves, reaching the charts, reaching your minds, keeping your hearts, creeping up, finding hey. emotions to touch, something inside to open you up, help you cope with the rough times and shit. I'm sending hey. love because hey. we ain't prime and shit. Mm. My nigga, y'all niggas ain't shit. Yo, and that was to Drake, you know. So now I wonder if that answers my question if he's more closer to Drake than with K Dot. But then at the same time, Drake is down right now. Like, you know, if you got friends and you meant to be someone's friend, you meant to be checking up on them, not when they're up here living. No, you need to be checking on your friends when they're at the bottom. That's when it counts. You know what I'm saying? So I guess he's kind of trying to inspire Drake to try and get back in the studio to produce music. I'll stop doing all the crap he's doing right now. And this is like big bro talking. That's just a like big bro. Drake is old, isn't he? Shit. Still, <laughs> let's roll. Y'all niggas ain't stopping me. Y'all niggas ain't stopping me. Okay. Y'all niggas ain't stopping me. Y'all niggas ain't Yo. This is a work of art, you know. I fucking like this track. I'm gonna have to pl play this all over again. Yeah, this is why J. Cole will always be in the top two. I'm not even talking about top three no more. We need to stop this top three, top two, man. Yeah, that's real talk, fuck that. Yeah, I like what, I like what he did here, and I like how he addressed everything too, masterfully. This, yeah. Yeah, guys, thank you guys for tuning in. Like and share the video. Helps me to get into the algorithm that's been allergic to my channel for a while now. So, you know, help me out. Um, subscribe to the channel. Um, if you're new as well, go follow me over on Patreon as well too. And I'll see each and every one of you in the next reaction, man. Take care. Be safe. Stay blessed.